Hi, it's Shannon sending positive vibrations and love just at my favorite place, the park. And I decided to create some content. And I just wanted to say something, some of my thoughts. You know, hope can be a dangerous thing. <laughs> and having no hope is also dangerous. So it's hard to say what is better because sometimes hope is the only thing that will get you through, keep you moving forward because you're thinking of a change that's gonna come. It's believing in the things unseen, things that don't exist yet, untangible. Believing that you can create something better out of nothing at the moment because that reality doesn't exist. If you're sick, believing in your health, believing you can get healthy, believing you can be well. If you're poor, believing you can get rich, believing it's possible to get a job when you're unemployed, believing it's possible to meet a partner who will love you or family or whatever will love you despite all your problems and your, because everybody, let's face it, no one's perfect. Everyone has imperfections. So it's about finding people that will accept our imperfections. And uh, that hope is sometimes the only thing that keeps people moving forward. And it's a dangerous thing because sometimes you can hope all you want, but if you're not actually taking actions, doing the disciplines, doing something, like, you know, people don't just win the lottery without doing other things. You can't plan your whole life based on a lottery win. You know, you've got to do things to make your life better now. And uh, that's the thing, right? Hope is a dangerous thing, but it's also dangerous not to have hope. Because that's when you see, you know, people committing suicide, people getting addicted to drugs and stuff because everybody wants a like, everybody wants to be loved, everybody wants you to compliment them, wants to feel good about themselves, wants to be confident. You know, nobody in this world doesn't appreciate love. So, although hope is dangerous because sometimes you aren't actually doing things that will actually make the hope transpire, you know, you've got to actually take action in life. Nothing can be done with just thoughts alone. It's thoughts, actions, the discipline of doing something over and over again, be it going to work, be it going to school, be it walking through the park, be it running, be it studying, be it trying to sell a product, you know, and then learning of strategic ways to sell to people. It's selling yourself, you know, you've got to always be selling yourself, sell yourself on the idea that their hope is believable, it's possible, whatever your dream is, it's possible, whatever your goal is, it's possible, anything is possible, if you believe it, anything is possible, if you try to achieve it, and you've got to really make an effort, it's not just about thinking positive thoughts, thoughts alone can't do it, thoughts, actions, discipline, steps that you're taking towards it, doing things. You've got to constantly be doing, moving forward. So hope, you know, that's really what pulls me through in life. And uh, it's always been the light I see at the end of the day. Hope, you know, because you can't hope that the bills will get paid. You can't hope that your rent is going to get paid. You can't hope your mortgage is going to get paid. You can't hope that hope is not going to fill your gas a tank. But Believing in that hope, in that possibility, and doing things, applying for jobs, trying to get educated, learning, reading books, uh, taking steps and actions that will help make that dream into fruition. Because you've got to plant the seeds in life. Right now it's the fall, this is harvesting time. Those seeds you planted, if you were training for a marathon, you're running tomorrow in Toronto Marathon. You know, it's those seeds you plant and the daily actions that you water. You're the water, you're the sunshine. That's a plane flying over me. You're the water and sunshine of your life. You've got to make those ideas grow and bloom. You've got to fertilize it. I mean, you can't just expect things to come 
into fruition without action. And it's not just thoughts, you know, even just keeping a job, maintaining a job, maintaining positive words to your family, to your friends, saying, complimenting them, saying they're smart to your kids, telling them they can do it, they're smart, you know, they just keep trying, you know, because everything is hard in life, but if you keep at it, eventually, you'll kick, it'll kick in, you know, it's like, you know, if you ever take programming, your programming, Java, anything of programming nature, you know, it's like a new language, a new code, and it's like, what the hell is this, right? But then, if you keep at it, eventually you start to comprehend it, you start to understand. You know, it's like calculus or algebra or whatever, these mathematical equations, you know, you can't just plug in numbers without understanding the principles, and first you have to do the groundwork of learning them. And once you get the groundwork in, you know, the groundwork of building, being a content creator, the groundwork of whatever your dream is. Once you put that work in, you actually do things, it will transpire. And that's why hope is not just a thought, it's not just a feeling, it's a belief. But it's a belief with action, you know, because you can't just hope you're going to meet someone and stay uh, on a computer all day or stay in your house and hide out. You know, you, the only way you actually meet people is if you're actually outside talking to people, open to conversation, open to communication. You know, you have to actually get yourself out there to actually make things transpire and come to life in life. So I hope you have a great day and uh, I hope this helps you. Just remember hope can be dangerous, but it's more dangerous not to have hope because hope is the, because hope pretty much is your faith and belief in yourself. Hope is that your faith and belief in yourself and God to bring stuff that you want in this universe into action to transpire. So I hope you have a great day and just enjoy the sunshine, enjoy the changing season. Season here it's fall, so we've got the leaves changing everywhere, the colors changing, and enjoy your life because. Truly, anything is possible with hope, faith, joy, and love, and with effort. Good vibes.